So I've been back for a day and I had to go grocery shopping because the refrigerator was absolutely disgusting. You know, it was all boys for two weeks. And now I'm sitting out in the Rumley Field. Hi, we are Luke and Heather Bell and we have eight children and we are just the Bells 10. So like I said, um, this is our first day back. Um, my husband asked if I wanted to run out and check out the hay for the Rumley Field. Uh, I said, first I said, no, I have things to do. But then I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna go out with him because this is his happy place. My husband loves farming. He grew up on a dairy farm. He loves farming. And so he come out, he says, I'm gonna check the field. So we pull in and he's like, well, do you want to like drive home and come back and get me? Or I can run you back so I can get these fields turned? Cause the problem is, is it's rained for four or five days on the hay that's been cut. So now we can't really sell it. We have to use it for our beef cows and stuff because people who have horses, they want really nice stuff. It's nice hay, but it's a little dusty. Um, and you know, I mean, we want to sell the best. And so I said, you know what, just go out there and cut it or, or fluff it up. And I'll just sit here and, you know, work on stuff, work on videos. So I'm going to show you my husband in his happy place. And if he's happy, it makes me happy. And like I said, I'm trying really hard to do things I wouldn't normally do. I don't normally come out to the fields unless I rake because it's just not my thing. But I've realized, um, you know, we got in a little bit of a tiff a while ago. And I think it's just because he's super tired. He doesn't feel like people care about what he's doing. And I just want to make sure I told him, I said, I love you. I'm sorry if I, you know, hurt your feelings, whatever. And I'm going to try really hard to come out to the fields and be a part of your life in the summer. So I'm going to make sandwiches and come out. And right now I'm just sitting here watching him. But I know he's happy that I'm here. And so let me show you his happy place. All right. So um, I'm still videoing myself. I actually meant to video uh, all his equipment and him. So let me turn the camera around. All right. So here's my husband. He's just kind of, I don't know if you consider it creepy, but he's like fluffing up the hay so it can dry and we can bale it. Um, so I see he's kind of hurry, but I'm actually doing okay. It's really pretty out here. It is kind of windy. So I'm trying to talk loud, but this is his happy place. He, he loves the fields. He loves haying. He loves everything about farming. And he says this is going to be his retirement. When he retires and we sell the business to our, our kids, we're going to be haying and doing chickens. So he's out there fluffing up that hay. And I'm just kind of hanging out. I thought about going to sleep because I'm on Hawaii time still. But, you know, I want to, you know, not be tired tonight or not be too awake tonight, I guess. So there he is fluffing up his fields. Luke in the fields. Giving her. I He's giving her. I think we might go golfing tonight. Two of my kids went to Grandma Doty's. So here's his, oh, sorry. Here's what, what in the world is going on? There we go, one of the tractors. This is the baler connected to that tractor. There's my tractor. That's the one I use with the rake. That's my equipment there. We got a round bale. Um, no, maybe that's what I use. No, no, that, I don't know what that is, honestly. And then we've traveled all over the place for the wagons. It's really pretty out here though. I mean, look how beautiful. I mean, it's just, it's a nice day. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to go farther. It's going closer. It's a little wet out here. I got my socks on, but that's okay. So this is just one of our fields. We um, have another one after it's on the other side of those trees. And we have some more, a couple roads down. So I told him, I'm going to come out here as much as I can, even if it's just, uh, you know, like sitting here, getting a tan, reading a book, playing on my phone. I mean, as long as I'm out here supporting him, I think him just knowing I'm out here, I think really makes him happy. And it shows that I care about what he's doing. And I do care about what he's doing, but it's hard because like we're a working family. And when he's doing things, I'm also doing things. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to get my stuff done. But I'm going to try, I burnt my lips. I'm going to try really hard just to be a part of his life. And when he asked me to come, I'm going to come whether I'm doing stuff or not. Like I was cleaning the fridge. I said, you know what? Let me put the rest of the stuff in the fridge and I'll come out with you. My mom's taking a nap because she's still on Hawaii time too. And um, so I'm just going to work really, really hard and do things I normally wouldn't do. 
put down things and not worry about it, worry about it later, and just really try and be a part of his life and be supportive, more supportive, and not stress him out so much. Because I can stress and I can get my husband stressed, and then we get in a fight. And I mean, we've been married almost 26 years, man. We shouldn't be fighting 26 years later. Good heavens. So I'm going to just try really hard to just be a part of this farming thing. Like I said, if even if I have to come out here with my swimsuit, sit in a chair, relax, sleep, I don't know. I'm going to do it. So, uh, yeah, he's getting close. I know he's trying to hurry, but I'm not, like I said, I'm not in a hurry. Um, we don't really have much to do. I'm going to make potato salad and hamburgers for dinner tonight. I should have had my mom make the potatoes for me. I am going to actually video that potato salad recipe. I come up with this recipe that has bacon and ant and um, capers in it. <laughs> it's so, so good. Okay, I'm going to show you my husband again before I go. All right, there's my honey bunny giving her on the fields, fluffing that hay up so it can dry and be baled. I think this is what we're going to be doing for 4th of July, basically in the fields, and that's okay. Boy, that tractor goes fast. Maybe that's my tractor. I think he's using mine. Because I don't remember mine being that old. So he's, and I know I'm never in this one. I don't know how to run that one. But no, maybe this is it right here. No, that looks too new also. That's got to be mine right there. That's my tractor right there. All right, honey, you're doing a good job, sweetie pie. Just take your time. Enjoy your fields. All right, well, there's my husband. Working hard for our family as usual. And I'll be putting on more videos of us getting this hay done as a family and making sandwiches and burgers out to the field. All right, have a happy fourth.